What's up guys, Widowmaker Josh here. I wanna go over a new piece of gear from KSR called the Hera. So the Hera is a boost EQ slash overdrive, depending on how you kind of set it. And you might already be familiar with their other pedal, the Eros. It looks exactly the same, has the same features, but this one's voiced to be a lot more aggressive, a lot tighter, and something to help out with detuned guitars, low tune guitars, seven strings, eight strings, stuff like that. But they wanted something for the more everyday guitar player, you know, somebody who plays six string and stuff like that, maybe you want some classic rock tones or something like that. So um, they put together the Hera pedal and the Hera pedal is a lot more transparent. It's a lot thicker of a pedal. And um, today we're gonna go over it and we're gonna put it against uh, the Eggnator Tweaker 40 and the PV6534. Right here we have a level and a gain knob. We have a feel toggle. It goes from fat, tight, and thick. And we have a mode toggle that goes from clip, clean, and dirt. All of this is accompanied by a tone stack EQ, bass, mid, and treble. And one thing to note that is your gain is lowered down. Um, these kind of don't work as much. They don't really have like the headroom to do it. So when you crank your gain up, you have more use out of these knobs. So here's the tone that we're working with with the Hera off. Let's turn this guy on. Now it's set to the tight, so let's fatten it up. That's why you kind of hear that roll off of bass end. Mm, the fat's got a lot of nice low end that I really like, so I'm gonna keep it there. Now, I'm gonna dial in a classic rock tone, something that I like to use with the cover band a lot. Go and gain it up. Pick our mode. So I'm gonna clip it. I don't want it to be that hairy for this. Now let's EQ it a bit. I want it to be brighter. I wanna scoop a little bit of mid. Add a little bass. So it's got a nice classic rock tone. I used to gig with a cover band for like four hours in a night, several times a week. And I, when we play that song or classic songs like that, I always reach for like a TS-9 or a TS-808. And this is how I can kind of get similar results with it. You can do stuff like. Put it on the bridge if you want it a little rounder. Maybe in the middle. So it's got a real nice classic rock tone. Now, that's on the clean channel. Let's reset all of this. 
And let's try the dirty channel and see what it does. So we'll put this on the dirty channel. This is a dirty channel on its own. Now it's an egg nader, so it doesn't get metal. We're gonna use the Hera to kind of get us there, so. Now I'm thinking thrash. Let's, let's try to get something a little thrash here if we can. That's got it right there. Ugh, dirt. Bring those brights up. Yeah, Thrash loves that. Scoop it a bit. Now it's Thrash, so we don't need too much lows. back to highs we're getting a little hiss Cool, so it does that. It will drive an amp into crazy town. So now let's go ahead and try this pedal out with the PV. Let's see what it sounds like in a more metal fashion. So give me a second, let me switch everything around for you guys. Cool, so now everything's reset. We're gonna start on the clean channel with the PV. So I'm gonna do the same thing. We're gonna get, you know, classic rock tone out of the PV clean, but we might not have to do so much. So let's try it out. Now it's got a lot of low, so maybe we try the tight. Put that bass back in there. Move up to the middle. I know it's a little light for you guys, but we're going to go ahead and um, Push it into Metal Town. So let's switch channels. We're gonna see how this channel sounds. Cool, so let's reset all these guys and do it all over again, so.
We don't need to add too much gain. Now, of course, we need a, a noise gate. My springs are being a little noisy right now with the Floyd Rose, but you get the idea. It can, um, it can really turn an app from... I mean, this is a PV. It's supposed to be awesome, right? But with a little push. Cool. Now, one last thing before we end this video. Let's make it tight. Let's turn this PV into a tight monster. So they say less is more. Go there a little bit. It's so tight, it's making my freaking springs just ring out. See if I cover them a little bit. A little more definition on the high end for the, you know, the cut. getting away with as little as possible. We're, we're just trying to, you know, overdrive. We're trying to push the input of this and tighten it up versus, you know, trying to use a bunch of gain. So you got... Cool. So that is the KSR hair pedal. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, check out the links. We got some more videos, some more shootouts. Don't worry. We're going to go into more detail. We're going to be shooting this pedal out and all the other KSR gear with a ton of different pickups, a bunch of different amps, a bunch of different stuff. So you guys can get a clear idea of what these pedals do to help sculpt your tone. I want to thank you all for tuning in to this video. Don't forget to click subscribe and the little bell button so you can get notifications every time we come out with a video. Till next time, people.